This is what is really going on in the crypto space. Fed starts new program to oversee crypto activity in U.S. banks. So just like the Fed controls U.S. Treasury, U.S. dollar movements in U.S. banks, they want to control crypto stablecoin movements in U.S. banks. They're just figuring out how to deal with this. We're in the early stages of this technology. Now here's an update from the Bitcoin ETF front. We have an insider, Galaxy Digital CEO, saying that his contacts from Invesco and BlackRock get him to think that this is a question of when, not if, that the window is probably within six months. And so he believes four to six months based on what the insiders are saying until the Bitcoin ETF is approved. Doesn't get more exciting than that. But if you're an early stage investor in these altcoins, let's dive into what's going on here. Coinbase layer two chain Base taps Chainlink ahead of mainnet launch, right? So we have obviously mass adoption of this blockchain infrastructure. No one is using anything other than Chainlink. Obviously, serious adoption behind the scenes. Here's an update from Algorand. One million passengers using the NFT tickets from this airline that's using the Algorand blockchain. And then here is an update from Polygon, obviously. They have huge partnerships starting to materialize. DraftKings, almost $3 million in 24 hours, the number one NFT collection in the world, just getting started.